Now our lives revolve around the internet and technology more than ever, but weak internet connections in some parts of the Wabash Valley have prevented some people from keeping up. News 10's Kaylin Hunt has more on possible changes coming to one county. If the pandemic has shown us anything, it's at least shown us that a strong internet connection is important. Now Clay County Commissioners are making sure that everyone has access to that. Clay County Commissioner Paul Cinder says broadband internet is present in Clay County, but it's just not at the strength that's needed. Uh, I know some people have it, but it's very weak, and so we really need to uh, uh, establish a better uh, system uh, uh, for what we have at the present time. Cinder says deficiencies in the current system started to show when it affected other parts of the county. When uh, COVID really hit us last year, uh, it also hit the kids. Uh, many homes in the county uh, do not have broadband and, and that affected uh, the educational system as well. With cracks in the internet system showing, commissioners are now making a top priority to make changes. And that could all start with a grant. Cinder says the commissioners are eyeing two grants to serve the northern and southern parts of the county. The funding would come in the form of federal ARCA money. That money goes towards things like broadband, water and other county needs. Cinder says their project to bring broadband to North and South Clay County could total around $1 million. While the commissioners are still working through the application process, Cinder says this grant money could bring numerous opportunities to Clay County residents. I think uh, this will be a major, major step forward for the people here in Clay County and not only the homes but for business and industry as well. Cinders tells me they expect to hear back about the grant sometime in March or April. Reporting in Clay County, Caitlin Hunt, News 10.